Cuckoo night, you causing trouble? Hello, this is gonna be a quick what I eat in a day video. Hope you enjoy, thanks. Causing trouble? So I have partially dinosaur kale, arugula, chard. And the great thing about juicing is I'll never have produce go bad ever again because if you know I see that produce is about to go bad, I just simply juice it. And I'm so proud of Cuckoo Knight because he actually likes his greens, unlike Geraldine. Check him out. And it's munching on some uh, parsley. <laughs> Aw, good cuckoo night. Yes, you get those greens. I'm gonna let him uh, sit here and munch out for uh, a, a few minutes before I juice this thing. <laughs> I just think juicing is incredible because I would have to sit here. This would take me like a whole like hour to eat all this <laughs> like it's a lot of produce so it's just so much easier for me to just juice it and extract all the nutrients and like I said in my prior video since I'm whole food plant-based I get an ample amount of fiber in my my diet a day about 97% of Americans are deficient in fiber which is crazy it's it's quite scary and constipation is one of the most common reasons children and even adults are rushed to the emergency room because the reality is they're not getting enough fiber and also animal products are known to uh, clog you up. It's just not uh, not something that's going to promote healthy bowel movements. I know this sounds kind of like gross but it's just reality. <laughs> the soluble fiber that was left behind because the juicer only removes most of the insoluble fiber however it does not remove soluble fiber which I prefer to strain out because I like my juice to be extra smooth and silky because then it's more pleasant to drink unfortunately I forgot to put apple in my juice I prefer to put some fruit of some kind in my juice to counteract the bitterness of the greens because if you don't put any apples in it or whatnot it becomes super bitter like super duper bitter four ripe bananas and these are like nice and ripe they have all the you know the brown speckles on them <laughs> brown spots on them so these are nice and ripe so I'm gonna tackle these bananas right now as a little snack <laughs> Chilly, you want a banana? nope he's not a fan <laughs> I actually don't like bananas that are any more ripe than this because 
Otherwise, they tend to have like a, I don't know, I'm just not a fan. I prefer bananas to definitely not be more ripe than this. I generally try to eat at least two bananas a day and preferably three or four bananas a day. It's uh, they're, they're just so healthy. They're one of the healthiest fruits. Geraldine, what are you doing? <laughs> Bye, thanks for watching. Don't remove the Asian lama a long, long time ago. This is the time of the apocalypse, the dream of the last thing.